Hey guys, so today I'm going to be talking about my new female um, western painted turtle, which is native to Ohio, and I think so is red Eared sliders, but I'm not exactly sure on that. And I, it is going to be kept with my um, red Eared slider named Philip, and that should be pretty cool. Um, I'll also be talking about some future plans that I have to do with the some of the fish and the turtle that I haven't named that are that's in there so um I'll be explaining that so hope you enjoyed this video stay tuned it's awesome I get bitten by, by the turtle you know it's actually quite funny that I had no thought at all to film picking her up but uh here she is it's really warm in Ohio right now like you know it's Ohio so if you guys live here then you know that temperature doesn't make any sense but it's like shirt and t-shirt warm right now and she's just in here I set her on my deck which we recently put a bunch of stuff she is so nice so I'm gonna wash her off she's just been crawling around here um, all her scoots are shedding right now because probably because like she just got like dried out because she was taken out of her tank um, Let's talk about her story. Inside. So this is the part where I wash her off, but I lost that film somewhere. Um, so I don't have it. So that's why she's all wet in the next thing. Because I wanted to wash her off because I just wanted to get, all, get anything off her. I don't know. Because she was outside and everything. So I just washed her off and then now I'm bringing her in. Okay, please. Before you start writing in the comments... I have well water. I do not need to dechlorinate it. It doesn't matter. Okay. Um, I just want to tell you guys just so you're not like confused. So here's my turtles and their gloriousness. And here's how big she is. This magnificent fella. Her name is Lola. According to um, the people that I got her from. So... Yeah, I'm just going to uh, put her in this tub here um, that has that so like the water keeps flowing and this is a basking spot and just to kind of get to know her and try to feed her and stuff. So I'm just okay, gonna... so it is now Thursday. That video was taken on Sunday and she's been doing really well. So basically this weekend she will be going in the tank with the other um, turtles. She's been doing really, really well. She eats out of my hand now. She's been eating lettuce, as you see. I've been changing her water, um, I think every other day, like full, like just changing everything. And let's see if she'll eat out of my hand. She tends to miss a little bit, so we'll see. Um, I try to feed her a roach, which will be, oh, there she got it. I fed her a roach, which will be in my so this weekend I'm making a 50 subscriber special just because it's pretty big for me I think um, where I'm gonna feed all of my animals as many as I can dubia roaches and like everything basically except my iguana. My iguana will not be eating because um, I don't know. Oh she's definitely gonna bite my hand. Oh jeez. Oh. Ow. Oh, okay. <laughs> That was literally the best thing that ever happened ever. She just really bit me and she wanted to eat my thumb as well. Oh, I, there's nothing, like, nothing happened to me. But, like... <laughs> wow. So, she she hasn't seemed to really eat um, food when I just, um, like, drop it in the water. But she'll definitely eat out of my hand, and she'll eat lettuce when I drop it in the water. She'll tear it up. I'll leave it in here. She'll tear it up. And she sometimes eats food off the ground, which leads me to another point. My rocks are too small. So this weekend, I'm going to be redoing all the rocks, so I'm then going to be completely taking down this tank. You see these two scratches here? I hate them. They make me mad. So I'm going to switch around the whole tank so then, um, that, like, so these are on the back. Here. Feed the fish real quick. And, um, I'm also going to be taking everything out and doing that. So I'll make a video about that. And then she will be going in with the other tur turtles. And I guess since I'm here, 
So you know how I've been talking about getting rid of that one turtle? Well, I'm going to be giving it to my friend. I think it's that one. I think so. Um, oh, jeez. Did you see that? So mean. So I'm going to be keeping Philip, and what I'm going to do is I have a friend, and his mom works at our school. It's not... I'm in the middle school, I guess, and she's in the elementary. Now, she wants an ecosystem tank this size for her room. So what I'm going to do is, since I know a lot about fish tanks and everything, and I recently got everything I would need um, from the owners who own this, I'm going to lend her all the things that she needs to run that tank, which I got from the owners of Lola here, and the other turtle, um, I'm going to give it to her and hopefully... And I'll get it back during the summer. And I'm also going to be giving her the bass, the bluegill, the bullhead, and the crayfish. So it'll only be Lola, Philip, and Yamato, which is the goldfish's name. And that's what will be in this tank. And then during the summer, I'll have a pond and I'll get everything back. So um, just wanted to make that clear. And, by the way, Lola will be fine. She's here. She's, like, not quite getting a basking spot, but, um, like, it's not like she has no light at all. She'll be good for now. But I just want to make that clear. So that's my, uh, future plans. Because two turtles in here is going to be a lot, and I think that two turtles and a goldfish will be... Okay, so let me just clarify. That didn't hurt, like, at all. Um, hopefully it didn't hurt her. Um, that, like... <laughs> Turtle's bites do not hurt. She has these two teeth looking things that uh, come like come off the top. These guys don't, so when they bite me, it just kind of slides off. She has teeth things, so it didn't it didn't hurt. I said like I said ow, pretty high pitched. Uh, didn't didn't hurt to be honest. Um, so I th I think I I just didn't like the thought of having. The reason that I was looking for a female is I didn't really. Th like the thought of having two males because I think they might be able to you know they might get aggressive or something like that I don't know I just I didn't I didn't want to have two males and to be honest I was only looking for one turtle at first but once I realized they were males I thought it would be kind of cool and I knew they already had like I didn't want them to be I didn't want my turtle to be alone basically and um I don't know it'd be the only reptile that I house like two of together so there should only be three of them for a little while and um, I'll probably be doing a setup video for the uh, um, the school the school tank if 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 they let me and um, yeah so that's future plans um, very excited she's very cool um, and very very friendly always comes out right when I come up to the tank um, or tub, or whatever. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like it down below. If you have any comments or concerns, put in the comments below. And if, um, you want more content, then subscribe. Have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, so, like before, I, I need to clarify on some things, because I don't get everything right on the first try. The iguana doesn't eat dubia roaches, so that's why I won't be feeding him, and he never really eats in front of me, so I'll probably have some kind of film of him. I'll try to get it. If not, then I won't. And I mean, like, feeding, like, the fish, the tur turtles, and the gecko will all be eating dubia roaches. Also, the people that I'll be lending the stuff to at school, they're going to buy a 55-gallon aquarium for it, so that's what um my other rated slider will be housed in along with the fish and probably a few more crayfish because they want an ecosystem pot and there was somebody who wanted me to shout them out in a video i forget who it was if you could put that down in this video or something please do and i will shout you out or really anybody because i'll just shout you out at the end of the 55 subscriber video as long as you're a subscriber you know what i mean okay have a great day cheese oh Ow. Oh, that's my thumb. Let go. Please let go. <laughs> okay. This is awesome.